Uh, I met Sahana in 2014. She was eight years old. Uh, she and her family were customers of ours at the bakery that my husband and I owned here in Charlotte. And one day she and her sister came into the bakery and asked what we did with leftover bread. They wanted to take it to a safe house where some young women who've been trafficked were trying to reclaim their lives. So um, they were, the family was tutoring and mentoring these young women and Sahana at the age of eight was teaching computer skills. We've seen Sahana at a very young age um, starting from delivering um, food uh, from, you know, Great Harvest Bread Company to trafficking uh, survivors in a shelter. So from then on, uh, we've seen the growth and the journey um, and it's been a really awesome experience for us to be seen from the inception all the way to where they are today. That same year, Sahana and her sister were deeply impacted by the death of their paternal grandmother. And her last words implored the girls to do something to help girls. And they took that to heart. Her parents took them to a side of Charlotte where residents had way less. So this deep disparity that they saw and lack of equity spurred them to create Foundation for Girls. Foundation for Girls is a a leadership mentor program for single mothers um, who has experienced homelessness, um, just need a little bit more guidance and a little bit more coaching, coaching to make it through life situations. It's been so inspiring to see Sahana um, grow the program. She's currently working on a FinTech platform for the program to expand nationally. I work with a lot of impressive kids, but Sahana, the way, we, the way I describe her is she doesn't dabble. If she is involved in something, she does it 100%. The most remarkable example of success is the 169 transformational journeys for 80 moms and 89 children. I don't think they ever thought that a decade later FFG would be the organization that it is today. To me, she's a star of her generation, a, a champion, and I, she gives me great hope for the future and, and what our world can become.